Good morning all of you. So today I'm very excited about this demonstration. So today we are looking at running Hello World container which will be a very very small demonstration. So I will be switching to my console and so first of all I will run uh, so for example I have installed docker already so you can see that and if I clear my screen docker run hello world uh, so can you see that when I run this particular command uh, so this is the message it has uh, it has thrown on my screen hello from docker and you can also see uh, that uh, it is uh, to generate this message uh, it has also shown me uh, what what is the process that has been followed uh, when i try to execute this particular command right so uh, what happens is uh, so if if i scroll up you can see that uh, the image is basically getting pulled from the docker hub repository because image is not really stored locally on my system and therefore the first step is it is pulling from the docker hub repository and uh, so container has thrown an output hello from docker and I will also be, uh, so for example, if I try to docker container s, so you can see that at, at this point in time, there is no container which is exactly running as of now, right? So uh, the only process, the only uh, the only execution that this particular container brings about is, it's just uh, throw the uh, message, hello world, and the container just got terminated. So if I clear my screen, docker container, s minus a if i run this particular command you can see that uh, my container has exited uh, uh, exited uh, a minute ago because it has done its job to print hello world on my screen and therefore terminated after that right so so for example if i run this particular command once again hello So you can see that uh, this time the image is already stored locally and therefore it is not getting pulled from a Docker Hub repository, right? So I also wanted to emphasize on the steps that it has uh, it has carried out. So for example, you can see that uh, the Docker client contacted the Docker daemon and, uh, and Docker server basically pulled the hello world image from the Docker Hub repository and post that if uh, you know docker server basically created a container from the image which has already gotten stored locally from the docker hub after being downloaded and produces the output hello world and after that the docker daemon stream that output to the docker client right so these are the four steps that has been carried out so this is it for this particular video hope you enjoyed thank you